some of the country's sports heroes gathered today to drum up support for local athletes who they say are not getting the help they deserve. Trisha Terrara has that story. Yeah. Some Filipino sports icons gathered together this morning at Resorts World in Pasay City to celebrate 100 years of Philippine sports. And since world-class athletes bring honor to the country, they chose Araw ng Kagitingan to mark the commemoration. Billiards master Efren Batareas, bowling champ Bongku, chess grandmaster Eugene Torre, and four-time hardcourt MVP awardee Alvin Patrimonio looked back to the glory days of Philippine sports. They also commemorated the heroism of Lieutenant Chofisto Ildefonso, an Olympian-turned-soldier and hero during the Japanese occupation. He was the first Filipino swimmer to take home a bronze medal in the 1928 Amsterdam Olympics. These living legends say the country is capable of producing more world-class athletes like Ildefonso, but of course, they need support. Instead of pataas, parang hindi pataas kundi pababa. It could be also the reason could be technology, okay? Nag-evolve masyado in different sports, especially nag-evolve. And a lot of funding is needed. And of course, um, it depends if sports is one of the priority of the country. Uh, and unfortunately, uh, in our situation, parang very meager, oh, napaka konti ang support. For Tore, it's about time that the government and sports enthusiasts to focus on sports where Filipinos can excel. Siguro mas i ano, i distribute yung support sa other sports. Like for example now, uh, if you notice, uh, nagkaroon na ng suporta ang uh, volleyball, especially women's volleyball. So makikita mo, nag improve uh, tremendously. It's a matter of support. The group has also come up with Taas Noo Incorporated, an organization that aims to lend a hand to athletes in need. Among the target beneficiaries is boxer and first Filipino silver medalist in the 1964 Tokyo Olympics, Anthony Villanueva, who is now bedridden. Kawawa yung present generation na to kasi panay na lang corruption, panay na lang sirang train ng MRT, panay na lang sunog, panay na lang rape, panay na lang gera. Wala pa tayong ibang may kukwento. And then I stumbled upon itong mga greats ng mga Filipino greats. Highlight na something na, na positibo, hindi yung hina-highlight natin palagi yung everything that's negative about us. Bata pa lang sila, nagsasanay na sila, nagpa-practice na sila para uh, mas lalong mag-improve yung skills nila. Uh, gayahin natin yung examples nila, yung ginawa nila para sa ating bayan. They emphasize that sports do not only make good athletes but productive citizens as well. Trisha Terada, Solar News.